Can you guys hear me? Is everything working good? Uh, how are we all doing? How are we all feeling? Obama. Obama sphere. What type of upload cycle is this? A very lazy one. But hey, it takes work to make videos, you know. Obama Diamond. Oh. Alrighty, boys. Now we just gotta wait for it to load. I should have probably done this before I started streaming, but that's okay. Because, yeah, using however many mods I'm using causes things to slow down a bit. But that's alright. What version? 1.8.1, I think. You'll see in just a minute. Obama dodecahedron. Mmm. <laughs> Hello, mutton. Hello. Another vid. This is not a video, this is a live stream. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, so today we're gonna we're gonna take whoever I don't know actually what which kerbals I have, I'm gonna take them to Duna. Actually it's Probably more likely I'm going to take a probe first, and then go with some dudes, and then maybe go with some uh, rover equipment and base equipment and stuff like that. But we'll see. I don't have that long today, I think I've got about three hours that I can stream. This takes forever to load. Yep, it does. This is why 60 mods is kind of painful. Especially because it crashes, and then you got to do this again. Oh, everyone's filing in. This is good, this is good. What time is it for everyone? Because I feel like this is an inconvenient time for just about everyone right now. But that's alright. Are you a frog IRL? Yeah, I'm a frog. No one's gonna say. 1.43 a.m. 2 a.m. Damn, I'm only seeing inconvenient times. Holy shit, that is a lot of times. Okay. 7 p.m.? Oh, that's not too bad. Where is it 7 p.m.? Is that in Europe somewhere? That's pretty good, actually. Alright, here we go, boys. Finally. I've had to fill the time. Wow, we've almost got 700 people in. We have over 700 people in. Oh my god. Time is <laughs> of no essence when playing Factorio. That's true. When you play Factorio, there is no time. There is only belts. And expansion. Yo. Yo. Alright, here we go. Now, oh, you can't hear the desktop audio, can you? I gotta turn that up. Wait, no, I don't. Can you hear this? Hold on. Can you hear that now? There we go. Okay. Uh, let me adjust the volume, because I think we, I think we want to hear things, you know? Let's put it up to 10%. That's better. Yeah. How's that for you guys? I hope that's good. <coughs> Alright, start game. So see, version 1.8.1. .1. Let us resume be in space program. Oh, the hell. Oh, yep. <laughs> Thanks, dude. Was that... Was that just then? My alert box has been going a little funky, so I don't I don't know what the deal is with that. Also, this is not the hell. 
Let me fix that. There we go. Okay, now you can see up here, you can see down there. Very good. Okie dokie. Was that just then? If so, thanks Caltrop. That's, that's cool. Okay. I think it was. So, what are we doing? It was. Amazing. We are... It's my birthday. Happy birthday. Oh. Natho. Booba. <laughs> so, I was gonna... I was gonna go to Duna. That's right. That's the one. Booba. So, do we have any things that we can do at Duna? We have this one. Place a relay satellite with a combined antenna rating of 15 G. I don't know how much 15 G is. Why don't we have a look? Oh my god. I that chat is very, very fast. Uh, okay, I was going to look at the antenna ratings. So what do we have? We have this one, which has 2 G. This one's got 15. Alright, we'll use... Alright, sweet. I'll take that contract. <clears throat> 3 FPS, let's go. Really? No. Looks fine on my end. Ugh, excuse me. Okay, so we're going to take that contract that we saw. The relay one. This one. Hell yeah. Anything else around Duna? Nope. Any exploration of Duna? Nope. Oh my god. <laughs> Ike or bust? Ike? Eh. Eh. I'd rather get on Duna. Scan set surveys. I don't know what half of these actually are. Alright, I think, I think that's what we'll take. So. So. What we want to do is we want to do some observing of Duna. Wow. I've only said that like 15 times. So. We... Okay. <laughs> you are the... F you are the funny frogman I need in my life. Thank you. I hope... I hope I can be uh, of service. Uh, what am I... What's going on in my, in my noggin? Oh, yep. <laughs> oh, yep. So we want this thing. The 15 G antenna. So we'll stick that there. And then we'll get some fuel. Do we not have any little fuel tanks? Not to worry. I will just make them little. Oh, cute. Actually, no. Big, big boy. So, oh my god, you guys are crazy. Kazakh, thank you. Jesus Christ. Uh, okay. Coupling. Oh my god. Holy shit. <laughs> Thanks, Andrew. <laughs> nice. I'm sad that, uh, yeah, the alert box doesn't seem to be working properly. I'll have to get that sorted for next stream. So. Uh, God, this is, <laughs> all these donations is making it so hard to concentrate. I'm sorry. Help me not fall into watching V2 Eclipse. Oh, what, what, what is, what is that? Sorry, I'm a boomer. So we want... Yeah, we want one of these, these scanner things. These are kind of cool. They let you, like, map out the surface of a planet. So, yeah, why don't we make sure that... Yeah, that's... <laughs> that's going to go sideways if we do that. So let's stick some experiments on this end. Some goop. Hmm. Absolutely, positively off the goop. That's pretty good. That's... Oh my god, you guys are crazy. Thank you, Marin. A 
Okay. Looking good. Oh, the assemblers are my friends. Funny frogman. <laughs> I guess that's me. You called? I answered. I received. So we have solar panels. Oh my... F Jesus Christ. Non-stop. Uh, let's put batteries in here. Very good. Now... Uh, uh, so we have the antenna. <laughs> so hard to concentrate. Have the antenna, we have power generation. I'm just going to go through each of these, to be honest. See if there's something we have missed. Utility. Ah, oh, yes, we've missed the massive ordnance airburst bomb. Damn. Or the uh, Zar bomb. Damn. I guess we'll have to do that next time. Okay. Ah, oh, these are cool. These little, uh, like, men portable experiments. I gotta try them out. I haven't actually used them. Oh my god. Silly frogman said goop. I did. Um. Okay. Yeah, we got that. We got all that. Um, do we need thermals? Probably not, but why not? Uh, I think we've got everything we need. Oh yeah, reaction wheels. That would be helpful. Let's just stick a little one on. Yeah, that'll do. <coughs> okay. Greetings from Germany. I love your videos. Thanks. Thanks for the two euros. Antimatter orb when? That is a great question. We, we will get to there at, at some point. I hope. Right? It'll just take a long time. So, now that we've got our probe, that's got 2,500 meters per second, we want to just... What do we want? I don't actually know what we want. I think we want a slightly bigger middle stage kind of deal. Yeah. And then we just get this guy. Mmm, orange. Oh, what the hell? Huh. And then we'll put this engine here. And make sure to put that in vacuum mode. <laughs> okay. Uh, that's pretty good. So now we need the booster stage. Oh my god, there's... 1,200 people in the stream. I didn't even notice. Welcome. We're going to Duna, gentlemen. We're gonna... Yeah. Do that. Um, okay. Huh. I may be stupid. I don't think we need this. Gotta keep it cost-effective, boys. You know? You gotta keep it cost-effective. Simple as that, really. So, I think... Is this a good engine? Or is it a... Is it a shit engine? No, that's a good engine. What's it at sea level? Ooh, that's pretty good. Does it have enough thrust? No. Well... We can make up for that with some boosters. What can't you fix with boosters in this game, to be honest? Make an orb. Yes. We'll create the all-powerful, all-encompassing orb. Now we want some control. Uh, right. This one. Uh, hold on a minute. Let's put these... Oh, no, don't do that. Let's put these sideways. So that we can do that, which makes it a bit easier to control. Okay. Oh, I almost forgot. We need... Does this have fuel? It does. Okay, that's useful then. 
We need a fairing. Oh! oh yeah. <laughs> 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 okay. Thanks, uh, Spastic Ninja. <laughs> so that works. It's just the Super Chats alert doesn't seem to work. Oh well. <laughs> I'm glad that one works though, because that one's funnier, to be honest. Hello? You gonna... Okay, that's... No, that's ridiculous. Alright. Gotta curve it in. There we go, boys. There we go. Wait. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> Thank you, Caltrop. Oh my god. Is that really loud for you guys as well? Because I hope it is, because I really just want you to feel the pain every time someone does that. Come on, there we go. Okay. Nice. Oh my god. Expand brain with booster orb. Mmm, that is quite the expanded brain moment. What are we going to name this ship? That's the next question, alright? Everyone tell me. What is the ship called? I don't want it, I don't want it to be an Obama thing, because Obama is for crewed missions. So, there's the, uh... There's the rule. The rules are... Oh my god, you guys are crazy. I made it, despite your directions. Uh, come on. Which one? It's pretty loud. Good. <laughs> what are we calling it? Where's Kevin? Struts. No. Oh my god, it's way- <laughs> The chat is way too fast. Watching this over my actual aerospace lectures. Hell yeah. <laughs> Alright. Uh, well, I'm gonna call this... Uh... Joe Bido. <laughs> yes. What? I couldn't even read that. Wear Obama Prism 6-9 so we can all- Okay. Oh, what the Globama. Joe Bidome. <laughs> <laughs> I think... I think we're good. Should I simulate it or should I just go for it? It's only 40,000 credits. Let's just... Let's just hit it. What could possibly go wrong? Casting couch. I've already called one casting couch. I'm sorry. Oh my god. Casting couch 2. Shit. <laughs> okay. I've not thought this through at all. When no I don't think we're anywhere near the transfer window. I'm a sausage of a human being. So... So basically, if we align the sun and Kerbin on like a, a straight line, we want Duna to be about 45 degrees. So if this is 90, just bisecting that would be about about there. So we got to time accelerate forwards because Kerbin orbits faster. And then we'll be like there. Duna will be like there. And then we'll, yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, yep. Uh, okay. Thank you, Bearded Duck Witch. I've, I'm not going to turn that down. No, nah, fuck that. <laughs> Feel the pain with me. So. I can't undo this time acceleration, by the way. Because I'm... Yeah. Uh... So we could do it the proper way. I guess we should... Oh, what am I doing? Where's Kerbin Alarm Clock? Add. Uh, transfer window. Transfer planet, Kerbin. Parent. Oh no. Parent, son. Starting from Kerbin, going to... Shit, I passed it. Shit, I passed it again. Duna. Ooh, add alarm. 185 days. Oh my word. Alright, well, let's just time accelerate. Go. Hold on a minute. EA Sport. Go fast. 
Joe Biodome, not Joe Biodome. <laughs> well, yep. What the hell was that? Oh, shit. I would like to, I would like someone to please tell me what that was. I hope that was the camera and not the the planets doing that. That would be kind of kind of kooky. Oh. Oh. Thank you, Andrew. Good job. Good job. All right. <laughs> We're doing it, boys. We're doing it. I was completely wrong about the transfer window, by the way. Uh, it's Duna that needs to be on the straight line and Kerbin that needs to be about 45 degrees. So, yeah, good one, me. Because Kerbin's orbiting faster. So you, you end up going like, like that kind of thing. I don't know. So, we're at the right time. Have we lost all of our power? We have. Great. Good. Good job. Good job. It's okay. We'll just relaunch. Because, yeah. And then we'll... Watch, it'll be fine. Just a mild slowdown. <sighs> He's spinning. Am I spinning? My head's spinning. Bean peen one. Nice. Joe Bidome. <laughs> Let's launch. No power. Yep, no power. The staging, please fix it. I probably should do that, shouldn't I? Uh, that donation thing needs to be louder. Well, yep. Mm. All right. The staging's fine. Uh, I guess we should do that, right? Because yeah. Okay. So these fire, these pop off. Then this runs out. Then that pops off. Then this activates, then pop the fairing off and do all that. All right, sick. Let's go, boys. Three, ooh, where's the clock? Three, two, one, go. Hell yeah. Rocketing off the pad. Joe Bidome penetrating space. It's really as simple as that. Look at how good those plumes look. That looks nice. Hell yeah. Actually, I'm not going to pitch over quite quite that aggressively. Look at us go. I bought Factorio because of you. I've never been more addicted to a game in my life. Also, you should, you should make another Discord. I'll do that soon. Yeah, Factorio is... is crack. <laughs> it is... it is... it is crack. Just... N no, nothing more to be said, really. Alright. How are we doing? Oh, we should pitch over more. Oop. Oh, uh, we don't have... Fuck. Ah, no. We don't have maneuver nodes. I just realized. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm gonna have to, uh... I'm gonna have to go and upgrade the tracking station. If we have enough money, which we might not. To get maneuver nodes. Factorio server win. Hmm. Good question. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. We will see. Uh, we're kind of up in space now. I can probably just pop this guy off, right? Right. Yeah. Yeah. Pop that off. Alright. Going to space. I think I've over 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 engineered this rocket a lot, because this is actually surprisingly efficient. And I think this whole stage is going to take us to orbit with no problem. We're not going to have to use any of this. Which is nice. Alright, let's get to 80 kilometers and then just cut the throttle. You guys ready for the loud music? Here it comes. 
It's probably not going to be loud. Ooh. <laughs> there it is. Okay. Going up a little bit. And we keep going. Almost 2,000 viewers. Good lord. This is Kerbin. Yes, it is. It is not Earth. It just looks nice, because I got those environmental enhancement mods. How much... So, I was going to check. How much money do we have? We have 478,000. Is that enough to buy the level 3 tracking station upgrade in hard difficulty? Someone please tell me. Okay. Well, I don't need someone to tell me, because I'll go and find out now. Joe by Doom. Alt F4 for tracking station. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Alright. So it looks like we're going to have to do this entire mission blind ish. Which is why we have so much fuel. So it was actually entirely planned for. That is really expensive. That was like 1.9 million, I think. That's kind of crazy. Not to worry. Not to worry. So. Now, from my experience, which is not very much, what we need to do is kind of eject... Start the burn around here, and that'll kind of push us forwards in the prograde direction for... Kerbin's, like, orbit, and then it'll push us around, and we'll get to Duna. Wish me luck. <laughs> so, I think I'm going to start about there. Let's just go on Kerbin. So, around here is probably where I want to start the burn. Uh, also, 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 before I run out of electric charge, pop these bad boys. And check if we have science we can do. We do not. Nice. Alright, we got our power back. Very good. Everything's... Everything seems to be in order. Oh my god. Holy shit. <laughs> Thanks, Snowgadoggo. You don't need Tracking Station 3, you need Astronaut Complex 2. For patched conics? I'm pretty sure you need Tracking Station. I'm pretty sure astronaut complexes you take surface samples. Does it not? Or, no, it allows you to EVA. No, that's the, um... I'm just dead wrong. That's the... The one. Yeah, you guys know. Okay, we're gonna start the burn here. R&D facility. That's the thing I was thinking about. 50 bucks. Dude. Dude. Thanks. And it's United States bucks, which is, like, a lot more than Australian bucks. Let's go. Wait, fuck. <laughs> I'm not that. I'm the probe. Okay, now do it. Come on. Turn over. Go, Joe Bidome. I'm going to pop these together. We have so much Delta V. This is, this is not even going to be a problem. Worry not. Mission control. For patched conics, I'm pretty sure for maneuver nodes, you need tracking station. Mission control just gives you contracts. Uh, don't ignore me, peasant. Take a look. Okay, well... Just give me a moment. Just give me a minute. I'll finish this burn and then I'll take a look. <laughs> Rip Snow Doggo's wallet. <laughs> yeah, I will take a look, alright? In just a minute. It's mission control. I'm thinking of... Yeah, I don't know what I'm thinking of. We will see. 
And boop. Okay. Space Center. More alt F4 fours. Yes. Awesome stream. <laughs> really? <laughs> Patched conics visible in map. Ah, it's unknown object tracking, I see. Flight planning available. Aha! Tis mission control. Thank you, sir. Yeah, I figured that because uh, the patched conics thing is tracking station, it would have been in tracking station, but it's not. Lucky us. Or have I completely... Astronaut complex, advanced maneuverability. Oh. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> I may be stupid. <laughs> Hello? Okay. No, it's not the astronaut complex. Definitely not. And it's not administration. Yeah, I think I think we're good. The donation thing needs to be louder than the doom music. Okay. <laughs> Control W is the fastest way to get to the space center. <laughs> nice. Wait, I'm wrong. Dude. Dude. <laughs> Fuck. Man's made of cash. Hey, maneuver nerds. Okay. Let's... We got one minute, 40 seconds to make this maneuver. I th oh, Literally, I think we just all... All we have to do is just go forwards. Yeah, see, it's, it's really that easy. I could have done this without the maneuver nerds. Come on. Let's just prograde. Alright. In fact, fuck it, no maneuver nodes, just go. Now, we gotta be precise. Lots of precision. Give it a minute. Give it just a minute. And... Boosh. So now we focus on here. And check that out. Awesome. So now what we do is we... Uh, hold on, let's go back to our, our craft. We wait for little Joe Bidome to leave Carbon Sphere of Influence. Out we go. Adios. Okay. And now that we're here, what we can do... No time warp challenge. Nice. So now what we can do is focus our view on Duna. And then see, this is our current trajectory, but we can move it. That's the wrong way. We'll move it closer. Very good. Very good. Shit. There we go. That'll do it. So now what we do is hop on over to our maneuver node. And uh, yeah, sick. Unmute, you are muted. Yeah, funny. <laughs> F funny. Hilarious. <laughs> we can hear him. Shut up, fools. Foolish! Are we still... Hello? No probe control. What? No power. Oh my god! Uh, this is not actually that bad, don't worry. Basically, these solar panels, look at that, they're perfectly perpendicular to the sun. So we're just gonna wait. Literally just go forward in the orbit. Obama bin Laden. Frog got me addicted to Factorio, so now we're past the maneuver by 14 hours, but that's not a big deal. Now we got power. Yeah, okay, we should be fine. Yeet. I agree. Ooh. Jump. 
gently does it. Okay, we've definitely messed that up. That's all right. That's all right. Look at it wiggle. That's so weird. Okay. Give us just a... Just a minute. Okay. That'll do it. Joe Biden is Obama. He is. <laughs> it's amazing. All right. This is gameplay. This is <laughs> this is what you do in KSP. For those who don't play this game, can we have a moment of silence for Jeb? We can. There it was, our moment of silence. Yes, everyone put F in the chat for Jeb, because he is very dead, and will continue to remain dead for the rest of time. So, okay, we're good now. Let's, yeah. Yeah, more Fs in the chat, please. Please! Pog. I see you there, Cameron. I see you. F's. That's... There we go. There we go, boys. <laughs> it's as simple as that. Look at it spin. So... Where's our contract? Apoapsis below that. Ah, easy. Actually, oh, I just thought, right? So, because we have that multi-spectral scanner thing, whatever. What we should do is... Let me get really close. There we go. Is actually put it in a polar orbit. A little bit... A uh, little bit high up. Like, around there. Because if we have a look... Yes, this is Pog. But why? <laughs> Do, 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 do. Scan altitude 300 kilometers is ideal. So we want to put this down to 300 kilometers. How did Jeb the Overlord die? Have you not seen the first video? That was one of the plot points. He hit the water at Mark 2. Which is tends to be bad for you. Okay, now because this is such a small maneuver, I'm going to turn the thrust limited way down so that it's nice and precise. Hey, can I give a shout out to Mo Lester? Thanks, Emerald Guy. Ooh, there we go. Look at that, that's perfect. So now we're going to come in over Duna. And then I'm going to slow on down. And everything will be good. Excellent. Look at us go. <laughs> Give me get a shout out. Nice. Nice. Ooh. Learning music. Music of learning. I think in the next video I'm not gonna... I'm gonna use different learning music. Because, you know, there are multiple YouTubers that do that... That kind of stuff. That's... Not good. That's signal strength going down. That's... That's bad. Our antenna's so powerful, though. I guess because the ground-based antenna is not... So, burn is over half an hour. <laughs> you are correct. Let me just turn that up. Okay, burn time 41 seconds. What? Ah, oh, fuck, I missed that. Oh, okay. I, I, I ain't gonna say that, buddy. 
I hope pe people clapped for Jeb before he died. Oh! Are you fucking kidding? Ah! Oh my god. <sighs> Guess who just fat fingered it and warped straight past Duna? I'm s <laughs> This is angry Martino noises. I can't move it. Oh, this. This is just bad. This is just bad. Can we get some F's in the chat for what just happened? That was. That was actually terrible. Can I. Okay, I can do that. So. Oh my god. That's just. That's horrible. That's just. It's, it's terrible. I'm gonna point up. That is not up. We're going to point this up. And we're going to burn and see if we can get back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so shit at this game. My f fat fingers. Oh my god. Yafar. <laughs> Thank you. Quick load. Bro, do you see a save button? Oh, there is a save game button. Oh, well, I can't do that. It's hard mode. Can I even quick save? No, I can't. Oh, I can. Well, shouldn't be allowed. I'm not supposed to, so I won't. Don't worry, bro. This stuff ain't rocket science. Damn, true. What did that guy say before? POV, you are Jeb <laughs> for water at Mark 2. <laughs> nice. Am I seriously? This is this is piss. This is pee pee poo poo. This is anti pog. Thank you, Cameron. Cameron understands. We have so much fuel <laughs> that it should not be too much of a problem. I'm just mad. You need to quick save. No. Whatever happens, happens. It's as simple as that. If you cannot deal with the consequences of your actions, you should not be playing this game. I think if I just accelerate, I'll make it. Budlung! I can use maneuver nodes. Holy shit, you guys are... Jesus Christ. The meme frog. <laughs> this is... <laughs> I have to concentrate on so many things right now. This is very challenging. I appreciate your patience. We have so much fuel. I don't even care. Just... just let's just get there. Simply put, let's just get there. Come on. Really? They're so close. Oh. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, oh, there we go. Okay. And we have control again. Somehow. Let's go. We have so much fuel, I don't even care. <laughs> I'm losing all my viewers. No! No! Stay! No! Goo goo gaga, please stay. Okay, now we want to move... ...the... Maneuver thing inwards. Okay, looks like I'm gonna have to do that. Cool. Uh, 300 kilometers. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Holy shit! 
You guys are insane. <laughs> Meme frog misses planet unpog. This is an anti-pog moment. It is. It really is. China ate a bat. Yeah. I guess so. If anyone is following what's going on right now, who doesn't play KSP, I, I, uh, that's impressive, because this is very obtuse. Okay, this time, we're going to just keep it simple, and not time warp through the entire thing. That would probably be good, wouldn't it? In fact, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it onto standard warp, which might keep it from... Yeah. Doing all that. <laughs> hey, remember when you didn't have 100,000 subscribers? <laughs> you know what? I do. <laughs> Who'd have thunk? So. We can do our science. Look at us. We're here. We're at Duna. Let's do some science, boys. No in-range... Okay, well, let's not do some science then. <laughs> we'll just keep these. These two are one-off use, so we're going to wait until we're nice and low. He didn't miss. He just did a gravity assist. No, I, I did miss. I've just corrected the miss. It's because I time warped through it. Alright. Can we... Do we have probe control? Limited probe control. Why were we able to control it before? Why are we not able to control it at all now? Oh, because I'm time accelerating. Erder. <laughs> Good one. All these dudes talking about anti-pog, but forgetting about the original pogant. <laughs> I agree. That should be a, a more used term. To not pog. To pog not. Okay, I gotta... I gotta stop that. You guys like that blah 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 noise? Can you hear that? <laughs> Ain't that good? Blah blah blah. Blah blah blah. Look, there it is! In space high over... Yeah, damn. Oh well, we'll do these two as well. Save those. Excellent! Go! Slow down. The only dudes I talk about are my boyfriends. Nice. Pogant. <laughs> pog to the negative one. <laughs> yes. Inverse pog. <clears throat> so. We're gonna stay at exactly 300 Ks. Well. Not that part. This part. Look at us. So much fuel. Time warp a little. And... There we go. They're within like 50 meters, that's good. You got pogged. I did not. If I had gotten pogged, it would have been good. <coughs> Excuse me. So, we can activate this thing now. Start scan. Multi-spectral. Now, if we... Oh, how does this work? It's one of these buttons here. It's this one. Look at that. Scan planetary mapping. There we go. <laughs> this is of Kerbin. How do we change that? Celestial body. Duna. Hey, look at that. I have no idea what any of this is, but it's pretty cool. Uh, scan overlays. Scan instruments. Zo okay, what is that? I don't even know. So, now if we time accelerate, are we going to start to see this map get created? Or nah? Hello? Hmm. Hmm. 
Yeah, I have no fucking clue how this thing works. Surface and daylight. Aha! Effigeb, the only overlord of KSP. Facts. So, n or okay. So this thing apparently only works in the daylight, which I guess that makes sense, right? I don't need to move it closer. It's at exactly 300 kilometers. See, 300 kilometers, ideal. Look at that, 300,000 meters. But it needs to be in daylight, so that's why. Yeah, surface in daylight X, but any orbit will pass over daylight, so just give us a moment. Maybe. There we go. Surface in daylight. Hey, look at that. It's working. Why is this still doing that? Let's stop that, mister. Okay. That's cool. I have no idea what it means, but it's cool. Can we see high, low, multi, vis low, vis... Ah! I think this is the percentage of the scan that's been completed. So we've done a 0.4% of the multispectral scan, or whatever it's called. Joe Biden made it. He did! He did. Do we have the contract? Relay antenna combined at least 15G. Hello? This is a relay antenna with 15G. Hello? Bing, 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 hello! Maybe it just needs to get closer. Negative log of Pogant. <laughs> nice. Oh, and look, on the map we can actually see the scan that it's performing. Oh, that's really cool. Can I make this larger? I don't think so. It's cool though, zoom map. Uh. <laughs> uh, hello? Here we go. And now we're back in uh, nighttime. So over time, right, because Duna rotates, it'll uh, it'll scan the entire surface. So if we just speed up time a little bit, look, it'll do a strip there. Very nice. Then it'll do another strip. Sick. We've done it, gents. We have begun mapping out Duna. You need to connect to the internet <laughs> to complete that objective. Here, take this. Hot, hot gas. That's that's how this engine works. Hot, hot gas. <laughs> Alright. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Let us go. Oh, that's so cool. It's working really well, actually. Look at it, look at it zipping around. So soon enough, we'll have the entire thing scanned. The entire planet. Maybe. Hello. Why are these just not scanned? Huh. Look, you can, you can see it, like, kind of shifting to the left as it goes. Ah, there we go. So I think these gaps we can't fill in because they're, uh, they're kind of, uh, like it's a resonant system or something like that. I'm not actually sure. But that's good enough. So, are we still... Piss! Uh, I wouldn't worry about it. I guess... We might be able to complete it once the KSC comes back around to here. Because that'll be like nice and close. But in the meantime, let's build a manned mission to Duna. We're going to do it, boys. <laughs> Adjust orbit. I guess I could, but eh. can't be bothered. So now that we've been to, 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 to the Duna, there we go, land on Duna. 
Hell yeah. We'll take that. So I think we should send another probe. Because I like probing things. Hehe. <laughs> uh... Different probe. Has a thermometer. Orbits Duna within certain deviation. That's easy money right there. I can do both at once. So, we'll do this. New unmanned probe that can generate power. And then we'll land with the same probe. So these, these fools, they think they're getting a permanent thing orbiting Duna. These fools, they don't understand. Oh, it's hot. Much better. <laughs> Open the window. Okay. Oh, relay probe slash sat. Uh, it needs to be a new one, so I can't change the old one. So we need a new unmanned probe. So I'm just going to modify Joe by Doom. Also, let me know if there's any wind in the microphone, because it's kind of like the... There's a slight breeze. So what I'm going to do is, since this one worked so well... It is a bit expensive, but that's okay. What we're going to do is leave the relay antenna. Because... Uh, maybe not, maybe not, maybe not. Just build it in Australia and let it fall off. Oh, shit, true. Man speaking at facts. So there's 15 g. Let's buy that. So. Okay, I think what I really want out of this is actually. Bro, play Space Engineers. No. <laughs> I've played it, it's okay. Uh, so. Now what we do is we make a lander and a probe at the same time. Whoa. So all we got to do is land, which is not that difficult. Well, on Duna it's a little a little bit more tricky because there's a bit thinner atmosphere, but uh, nothing that eight parachutes can't fix. Get in there, mate. Get in there. Professional. Professional. Don't even talk to me. So now... Actually... No. No. It's going to be even simpler than that. It's just going to be a heat shield... And a probe. With some communication. What state are you in? I'm in a state of pain. <laughs> Uh, the, the big one with the most people in it. Uh, uh, uh. I think this is this will be fine because we have the relay satellite there anyway. So this will fall down, and then we will open the parachutes and it will land, and that will be all it does is in its entire existence. It's just fall and land. So to make sure it doesn't explode when it touches the ground, let's get a little bit of structural stuff in. In fact, what I'll do is I'll do this. I'll just scoot that down. Because I can jettison the heat shield, right? Um... Cool. Cool. Now, what if it wants to fly upside down? What then? I guess that'll just have to happen. Uh, we want electricity. Want some batteries. Get those in there. Want a couple of solar panels. This thing looks very nugget-like. So I think a good test is we can actually use the simula uh, this simulation mod and just like throw it into Duna's atmosphere repeatedly. 
which is what I will be doing. So, uh, where's the sub-assemblies thing? There it is. Sub-assembly drop zone. Let's just pop this in here. Let's call it Joe. <laughs> Who is Joe? I do not know. And then what we can do is just make a little test vehicle. A testicular vehicle, if you will. Uh, that'll do. Will it do? It really won't. It really won't. Also, is it still windy? Please tell me if it's windy. The little reaction wheel. Joe Bidome. Part 2. No, not 23, part 2. So now we hit Sim. Look at that. Orbit selection, Duna. Orbit altitude, 50,000. Start simulation. <laughs> to land on Duna, you need engines. Do I? Do I really? No wind? Okay, cool. Even <laughs> nice. I'm so funny. Alright, here we are. That was hard. So look, it's a simulation active. Sim costs money to use. So, first off, do we have control? Somewhat. Hey, look, they're linked. Just use engines for landing. Can't warp while in atmosphere. Not pog. Hello? Why did it do that? The fuck? <laughs> I think I'm just gonna restart. <laughs> what is your opinion on Benito Mussolini? Uh, his name is Benito, which instantly adds two power to his power level. Benito. Uh, just use engines. Who do, you, who do you think I am? Some sort of intelligent human being? Why? Okay, you know what? Just get in the corner. You stay there. Let's just... Let's slow her on down and just see if this works. See, we have this engine, right? Like, this this could land us. But, uh... Like, it could just kind of assist the parachute. Go down a little more so we're actually in the sun. Because the sun is pretty cool, yeah? Alright, we're going to wait until it's over that ridge. That'll do. Go. Go fast. Actually, because this is a test, I don't actually care. Let's just pop that off. I don't even know if we need a heat shield, because orbital speed and doing is so slow. I guess... I guess it's probably a good idea. KSP-3. Mmm. Uh, excuse me. What do I... I hope we're not going too fast for the parachute. I think it'll be alright, to be honest. I think we'll be fine. Is it going to deploy? Hello? Uh oh. <laughs> I think you guys might be right. Oh! That's a bit fast. Yeah. Yeah, I think you are right. But that would count, wouldn't it? Yeah, it would. <laughs> so, you know. Uh, what is that? Terminate simulation. Very good. Slow your time. Ah, yeah, maybe that would have helped. Okie dokie. I think what we need to do is just add more parachutes because I don't... I don't know. I don't. I can't be bothered, like, landing this thing properly. Imagine that. 
<laughs> That'll do it. All right. So, now we need... Let's put these solar panels on the parachutes. Very good. That's safe. Get some more fuel. And then get... No, that's the wrong button. And then get our sub-assembly named Joe. Thank you, Joe. You're all we need in this world. Uh, we just need a couple of... Cool, that's way cheaper than the last one. Let's delete this fairing and make it new. It is now pointy. Now, am I missing anything? That is the question. Engine jettisoned before use. Ah, <laughs> oh, sick. Okay. So that one pops. That one is not supposed to pop. That one pops. This one lights. Uh, I can probably... Hold on. Let's make a new one. So, pop that off. Activate the engine. Then pop that off, activate. Okay, cool. Joe Bidome Part 2. Electric Boogaloo. So, now we need a specific orbit... Antenna and can generate power. Yep, we got that. Thermometer. And we've got to be there for 10 seconds and then we're done. We can just leave, which I think is kind of hilarious. These fools, they think they're getting a permanent satellite. Little do they know. I knew that you loved Italians, so take my money. I also am wanted for 200 war crimes <laughs> in Mexico, Albania, and Croatia. Quite a diverse range of, uh, of countries that you've performed war crimes in there. I think that'll do. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Go. We got another bean extraordinaire. Bubble aquas. Thank you, might. Do you have ADHD or ADD? I don't have either. I just was born born in this generation. Oh, there it is. <laughs> yeah, friendly reminder, you can pay me money for that noise to be made for the entire channel. Well, for the entire uh, live stream audience to listen to. <laughs> Just a friendly reminder. So. I've, I've done a silly again. We're not generating any electric charge. So I might as well just recover this. And then warp to the thing. And then put it down on the pad. BD Armory adds weapons. I am aware. I am very much aware. In fact, I have it installed. Uh, clock. Kerbin to Duna. Sun. Kerbin. Duna. 142 days. Alright. Can I warp to it? No. Okay. Cool. Oh, that is... Jesus Christ. <laughs> that is eyeball pain. No science, only pain. Facts. Now, we're gonna put on EA Sport Warp. Because <laughs> that means fast, apparently. And we're gonna go... 139 days. Drrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
There's DLC for BD Armor and Nukes. Wow, is there? Tell me more! It's almost like I have that mod as well. Incredible. Simply phenomenal. Oh! Duna is Red Planet. Communism forever. Oh, yep. I too enjoy committing many war crimes. Thank you, Cameron. Okay. Ah. Give me a moment, boys. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Joe Bidome part two. I always love your videos and armor has some sort of team speak radio thing. Yeah, I think I've heard of that. But you need to host the server. I yeah, I'm not interested in hosting a team speak to be honest. No, boys, we've fallen off. We've only got 1,500 viewers. No. <laughs> That's insane. Last stream, I think we peaked at like 1,200, and now we're just constant at 1,600 right now, which is pretty crazy. Okay. So. Let's just check everything real quick. Check it's all lined up. I believe it is. Duna is our target. Uh, ain't nothing to it, but to hit go, and let me put that there, so, go, 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 full throttle. Let's go! Joe Bidome 2 on its way. on Twitch. You know what? Twitch looks like it's got a lot of problems right now that I am glad I'm not a part of. My math homework is nothing compared to this. No, dude, your math homework is much more difficult. <laughs> math is hard. Elon Musk to <laughs> take notes. Yeah, bro. Joe Bidome on its way. Pop those off. They did not explode on me. Is there any way you can watch your old streams? Yeah, there's a playlist on the channel page. Should just be called Old KSP Streams or something like that. And this one will go there. So guess what, you're all gonna be, f well, maybe, maybe not. You're all gonna be featured in the VODs. I've yet again done a much too steep of a turn. That's okay. Uh, m no, not steep enough. Not shall, I don't fucking know. The words, they escaped me. Let's pop the thing off. Pop. We still have enough power, yep. It's not a war crime if no one's left to talk about it. You know what? He's not wrong. Drez is a conspiracy shill planet. Yes, Drez doesn't exist. Alright, let's just go. Kerbin is flat. Look at how flat it is. Practically a pancake. I will dab, whip and dab for the VOD. <laughs> Do it for the VOD. Donald Trapezoid would like to have a chat with you, Joe by Doom. I do, I do quite like uh, the various shapes of current and former US presidents.
The moon landing was faked. Minmus isn't real. He's telling the truth. Minmus is not real. I can't go to Minmus because for some reason it just completely kills my computer. It's the only planet, well I guess moon, it's the only body in the game that uh, that does that. I've tested them all out. They're all fine. They all run at 60 FPS. Just fine. But Minmus, nope. Minmus has to run at 4 FPS. Go dinner or go home. Well, guess where I'm going! Did you guess? Was it Duna? Because that would be correct. So now, we're in orbit. Very good. And Joe Bidome is well on its way. Now what we're going to do is we're going to pop a maneuver node here. Okay, let's drag it back a little bit. Yeah. Come on. Ah, oh, perfect. Alright. I can make that even more efficient. Look, we can do it over... Oh shit, we can even use the moon as a slingshot. Mm. Does that help? It'd be kind of cool if it did. Oh, I can't see. Fuck, how do I add more... Ah! I don't know how this works. I'm confused. Help! I'm just gonna do that. Actually, just in case, I can do that. Okay. Now we need to... This game is surprisingly easy to play with just one hand. <laughs> Jeb may be dead, but we got that bread. Absolutely. Jeb is dead. And we have lots of bread. George W. By Pyramid. <laughs> okay. Here we go. All right. Start burn in 50 seconds. Sounds good. I will do that in just a minute. And go. Oh, what the fuck? No, don't do that. Stop. Stop. Aim at the blue, not the yellow. There you go, boys. Look at this gameplay. Look at us go. Fuck. Stage. 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 Thank you. Obama's last name is written on Minmus's North Pole. <laughs> well, I can't go there, so... Damn, we'll never find out. He said a no-no naughty. I would never. In fact, I have never. And there's nothing you can do to prove it. Not a thing. Oh. Yep. He's right. Obama's last name is written on Minnesota's North Pole. I don't get a single thing that you are doing. Well, thanks for being here anyway. <laughs> a true hero. See the little bar next to the thing on the bottom of the screen? It's going down. We want that to get to zero. Oh shit. Give us a moment. Close enough. Close enough. So now... We need to... Make it into this horrible orbit here. So, why don't we find out how to do that? Does it sound good to you? Because it sounds good to me. Let's 
just chuck a maneuver down here. All right. Oh my god. How do I do this? I'm completely inept. I'm, I may be stupid. It's not even maybe at this point. I just am. Oh! Your channel is one of my greatest internet discoveries today. Oh, thanks, dude. Thanks, broski. I've... I've made a terrible mistake. I don't think I can actually... Oh, no, I can. Yet again, I may be stupid. Yeah, if I just do it like that... Oh, what the fuck. <laughs> this is... this is very confusing. I think I want it to be... okay. Oh, fuck. Let's go by point one. I want these two lines to kind of equal each other, but they're never going to do that. Oh, that's pretty close. Let's go by 0 0.001. I guess that'll have to do. So that means... Oh, I don't know how this works. I'm very confused. Not to worry. We'll just, we'll just go. Give it a go. Secret tip using maximum time warp will get you anywhere. That is a fact. Oh no. Shit. Fuck. Ah. We don't have control because this antenna is way too weak. Damn. Damn, that's... Uh, I guess we'll have to go over here then. Because we should be... We should be okay once we're close to this satellite. Perhaps. Maybe. Maybe not. I don't actually know. Oh, uh, Battery's dead? Oh, the battery is dead. Oh, maybe that's it. Fuck. The solar panels are facing the other way. Ah! Come on. There we go. Come on. Turn. No. No. Wrong way. Wrong way. Come on. There we go. Okay. We can do this. It just might take a little bit of finagling. Cannot delete maneuver nodes. Sick. <laughs> I once got tonsillitis from eating an orange. Oh, yep. That's no good. That's the wrong way. For the national treasury of... The, for the personal treasury of the pog frog. <laughs> That's me. I'm the pog frog. Oh, this is painful. We can only do max throttle. Max or zero. Ah! Too far. You know you put on. S I do. Ah shit. Let me just charge up the s the batteries real quick. Put the panels in the sun. There we go. Just give that a moment to charge, and then we'll do some more maneuvering. It is I, Pog Frog. Turn on the alternators. Yeah, you can't though, because you can't turn on the freaking engine. Alright. Gonna have to be precise. I wonder if I can change the thrust limiter. Nope. Oh, that is some wind. Oh, that's still the wrong way. I no, it's, no, it's no longer I may be stupid. I just am. 
I'm sorry. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Poggy the froggy. Do you see that precision? That precision. Oh, next level. What can I say? Um, I wonder if these things run out. Who knows? These contracts. I wonder when they expire. Because I could just do... I could just land. You know, that would probably be easy. Because I don't know if this orbit might not allow me to be in control of the, the vessel. When you get there and have extra fuel to go to Duna's moon. <laughs> I'm gonna land on Duna. But I guess I could. It's just I don't have... I have a thermometer on it. Like, what's the point? I guess... Oh, I probably gets you some money or some shit. Oh, I don't know. Oh, I don't know, mate. Uh, control locked. Not pog. Are we learning the intricate details of rocket science? You're, you are observing rocket science right here. In the making. <sighs> well. How have your days been, boys? Oh, it's going in the wrong direction. <laughs> Ew. Okay, well, we got to change that real quick. Yeah, someone just said that. So, because I'm coming in this way and exiting that way, this one goes around this way, not this way. So, let's just... That's the wrong way. Great job. Joe Biden was Obama's, Obama Prism's vice pres. Wow. You learn something new every day. Uh, now, I keep choosing the wrong direction. More fuel spent. Dude, we have so much fuel it doesn't even matter. It matters not. <laughs> That's so bad. Ah, fuck it. Close enough. Time warp. Now watch me time warp this thing straight past Duna again. Like a complete Humpty Dumpty looking ass. So I think what I can do is actually just line up this with the periapsis and then just burn at the periapsis. Yeah, f f yeah. I'm not. I'm not going to explain it. Let me just do it <sighs> with some difficulty. I think. Think this direction. Okay, and now that's the wrong way. I warped past Duna four times in a row like a retard my first time. <laughs> nice. Good one! Oh, come on! What is going on? Oh, I can't... Yeah, we still have no control. That's great. <laughs> well, this is cool. So, I think if I go here, and then hit this button, it won't move me when I throttle it up. There we go, there we go. Alright, I'm just going to wait for these lines to intersect. Bing. Close enough. And then here, this is so inefficient, but here I'm going to slow down. I don't know if that's the right thing to do. Fuck it. ruh -roh. Oh. 
Oh. Bring it on in. Slow it on down. Simple as that. What can I say except simple as that? Lameo, you're my favorite YouTuber at this point. Aw. Thanks, broski. Alright. There we go. This is so stupid. But it just might work. See, we have so much fuel, it doesn't even matter. I, I am not worried in the slightest. We will be fine. Can we delete this? <laughs> we still can't. Sick. Alright, so now what we do is we point at one of these. I don't know which one is the right one. We want to rotate the whole orbit. This way. Wrong way. <laughs> Every time I choose the wrong one. So odd hearing your voice without a bunch of random cuts and special effects on the screen. Yeah, mate. It is. It is a little bizarre. I can't just fall back on the the editing, you know. Like when I'm recording the voiceovers, I take a lot of attempts because I'm not very good at speaking, speaking words when I read them. But uh, I can't do that here. All right, I'm just gonna slow all the way down. <laughs> this is so stupid. And then, we're going to time accelerate just a wee bit. This is going to go straight, and then we're going to go straight, and we're going to burn, and it's going to be great. Very good. Crack cocainus. Cocainum. Cocainum. <laughs> Slap my cucumber. <laughs> I will, I can, and will slap your nuts. Hey! Maintain stability for 10 seconds. Let's go! Boom. There we go, we've actually done a contract. Oh, that only took significantly longer than it needed to. Let's go. So next, what we're going to do... Oh! Slap my cucumber, baby. Next, what we're going to do is go over here. Can I get rid of this now? <laughs> no, of course not. Don't be silly. I'm going to go here, we're going to slow down, and we're going to come in for a good, strong landing. We're out of power again, aren't we? Yeah. <sighs> <laughs> Oh, we gotta wait like a year. Oh no, we don't. Okay, we're good. That was a bit silly. Alright, no need to worry. We'll slow down now. Bailiff slap his nuts. Rocket scientist Morty has now become confused cucumber slapper. That's me. <laughs> really annoying only being able to do max throttle or zero. Okay. That should be good. That should be fine. Gotta wait 21 hours to get to there. Okay. Fucking finally, I agree. Here we go. If we look down... Oh, let's fill up on power. Let's fill up on juice. I can't do that, can I? I can't aim in different directions. I have to use all this. Uh, let's face radial in. That might be good. 
Yeah, that's good. All right, mate. So, turns out we didn't need this stage, but that's okay. Now, I wonder, do we have probe control? I don't think we do. Hey look, they can communicate. Amazing! Urination for life. <laughs> I love urination. It's my favorite pastime. You see it lagged there, but then stopped lagging? See, Minmus does that, but it doesn't stop lagging. It's quite unpog, if you ask me. We don't even need a heat shield, it's so slow. How good. Yeah, I'm glad we're not using a controlled descent, because we can only do full throttle and zero throttle. That would have been a terrible thing. Alright, here we go. We're coming in for a landing, boys. Just gonna slow down with the remaining fuel. Pop this off, pop that off, and then just... Yeah. Maybe try a controlled descent. We'll see. Is he trying to land on Duna? No, I'm not. Clearly I'm not. I would never. That's just going crazy now. Doesn't know what to do. Okay, surface mode. Get a bit of time acceleration going. Bye bye. Jettison the heat shield. Mm. Probably should do that. Let's turn the minimum pressure down and the altitude up because they take a long time to work. Oh, I should probably put them all at the same altitude. Uh, let's do 1500 for all of them. Do not worry about the ground rapidly approaching. That's just a figment of your imagination. Okay. That should be good. Should be A OK. -okay. Spick and spam. Let's pop that on. Get some slowy downy action. Okay. Pop the shoots. Hey, look at that. Yeah, I'm going to do a controlled descent, actually. If at all possible. I don't know if this actually has enough thrust. Oh, it does. It's got twice. Twice the TWR. Very good. Ugh. <laughs> For the brainless in chat. <laughs> yes, you, you see this? Doesn't work. Hey, look at that. Five parachutes does do it. So last time we were too heavy but that's cuz yeah we didn't have this thing i'm just going to just going to dunk that off yeah this is this is actually perfectly fine sweet i don't think there's actually anything i can do to make this go wrong now i can't time accelerate i can't i can't move the capsule really cuz it's not got reaction wheels now i think we're good and boof Oh, she's a roller. <laughs> okay, I spoke too soon. <laughs> Stop! Stop at once. Okay, well as long as the parachutes are slowing us down, we're just gonna slowly roll down the hill. I wouldn't worry about it too much. <laughs> this is great. This is cool. Uh, excuse me. Are you reading chat? No. Bitch. They see me rolling. Yep. The pog frog has landed. Let's go. 
the pog frog is kind of rolling. Oh, we've already landed on Duna. I could just leave now, but I'm kind of enjoying this. It's kind of funny. Oh, stopped rolling. Oh, <laughs> continued rolling. Go pog frog. You just made it worse by jettisoning the heat shield. Did I really? I don't think I did. I think I. I think it's fine. <laughs> I love that the parachutes are still out. Come on, guys, slow it down. Come on. Okay, that's enough. All right, I guess it's not enough. We can't leave. <laughs> the pog frog has landed. Let's go. Someone said spontaneous constipation. I didn't read that, but I'm going to pretend I did. Pogging on my way down to Juno. That's what I'm doing. There it is. Spontaneous constipation. This is literally why I subbed. No time warp mission. That would just be pain. This is even more painful. Oh. a That's zero. We've done it. My headphones keep disconnecting. Oh no. Do any of you have wireless headphones? Because I do, and they are quite cool. I can just stand up and walk around my room whenever I want. No cables getting caught. None of that shit. Alright, this guy that keeps saying please notice me. Yeah. Just, just shut up, please. Come on. Okay, I guess that's not gonna work. Oh my god, we have a lot of money. Hey, we've done it. Wait, wait, what's the time? Oh, we got heaps of time. <laughs> Mutted zito pads. That's me. Bring a Duna stone back to Kerbin. Mutted zito pads. Thank you. I don't know what a Duna stone is. I don't know how to get it. So I'm going to do that. Scansat survey of Duna. That's cool. Okay, is there anything we can do on Duna that we haven't taken yet? Temperature scan experiments in different biomes. Could do, could do. This stream is sponsored by Raycon. Oh yeah. Next mission named Pog Frog? I think so. Uh, climate study of Duna. These all require being in different biomes and shit. I don't know if I want to do that. Kind of want to just land there and then come back. Ah, oh, plant a flag on Duna would be great. We could get more Kerbals as well. I don't think I want to do that though. Okay. Let us build a mission. <clears throat> a great mission. This will be the last mission of the stream because I'm getting bored. Are you guys all ready? Duna stone collect surface sample. I don't think it is collect surface sample because there are different things you can do. It's not quite that simple. All right, we're making a new one. We're making a new one. We're going to use... Ah, now, the initial problem, do we use an Apollo style system? So do we want a command module and then a lander can module that's separate that does the landing? Or do we just want to land it on the same thing? I think we want a separate one actually. So, actually we'll build it, yeah we'll build the lander first. So. This thing needs to be able to land and then take off. Elon Musk is very proud of you. Oh, thanks. Also brought to you by Raid Shadow Legends. Raid! Ah, yes. We will use the uh, Air 2 Genie nuclear missile. Yeah, we'll just stick like eight of those on there. Alright, cool. Uh, let's just uh, pretend this is not simulating. Pretend this is, uh, pretend this is real. Thank <laughs> you. 
Only masochists play career mode. That is my belief. Facts. I don't know why I've done this to myself, but I've I've locked it in with the video. I can't not do it now. <laughs> or or you. Yeah, this is not a simulation at all. This is 100% real. Yeah, these are definitely nuclear missiles. Yeah, fire. <laughs> oh shit. Where's it going? Oh. Where's the Aussie man gonna send little guys next? Who knows? Probably to hell right now. Right now it looks it definitely looks like they're going to hell. <clears throat> Name this rocket George Podgington. I think I'm gonna keep in with the Obama Prism series of rockets, cause they uh or actually maybe not. Where's the Aussie man gonna send these little guys next? Who knows? Alright. <laughs> bye bye. Oh, that was tiny. Oh, come on. You call that a nuke? Come on. And it's just gone. That was piss. Piss weak. Damn, I guess we'll have to just use a bigger nuke then. Damn. <laughs> I'd say we hit up good old Za Boba. <laughs> Wait, no Pog. Okay, I, I actually should name the next one Pog Frog. D just don't mind me, alright? I'm just performing incredibly important experiments, collecting valuable data. Look, all right. This is important. This is important. <laughs> that's an air-to-air -air unguided missile. Ah, that's why it didn't work. Because it's not meant for destroying the entire nation. I don't know. Boom, just boom. Simple as. Go! Fire missile! Uh oh. I think Urk is dead. Oh! <laughs> That's more like it! Holy shit! Wow. That's a big boom. Did we destroy every single building in the KSC? No. But. Oh boy, did we do a big batter boom. Okay, that's enough of that. We'll actually make the mission now. I came here because of the thumbnail. Thank you. Ugh. Took me four minutes. Precisely. Okay, no one died. We just lost like 200 funds. Boo-hoo. So I think the thing to do is to make a little guy. So this little guy needs to be able to take off from Duna. And also land. But the landing can be pretty easy because we'll just use parachutes there. But it just needs to get into orbit. It doesn't need to uh doesn't need to go all the way back home. So that shouldn't be too much of an issue. Spark. Kind of cool without the shroud, but I like the shroud. Okay. Now. Uh, excuse me. We're going Duna. Look at that thrust away ratio. That's kooky. I'll stick this guy on. That'll do. Uh, that's not... I don't think that's enough to get to orbit, actually. So, we'll add a couple more tanks. Nice and orange. Orange. Shit. We'll just kind of stuff them up in there. Just, yeah. Stick them up. In the grill. And we'll get some landing legs. Now, these are like four times lighter. And they're probably just as f effective. Effective. 
So, as we have established, uh, heat shields are completely unnecessary on Duna. So we will not be using that. I'll get parachute and more parachute for landing. We'll set the altitude to 1500 on all of them. Very good, very good, very good. Now we need science. Mustn't forget the science. Let's get that. Scanning arm, nah. 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 Hmm. Radar antenna resource mapper. These are cool. So, what's the best way to store these? Maybe I should make a little service bay. With all the experiments inside. Is looking a little top heavy. Oh no, that's fine. That's fine. <laughs> don't mind this. Now we don't need a ladder because um, gravity on Duna is light enough that you can fly just barely with a jetpack. I just nuked the entirety of Florida off the map. Watch me fix it with flex tape. Let's go. <laughs> Skipped frames detected. Oh no. Alright, science. We'll get two of each. Oh, we won't get two of them, they're very expensive. Get two of these guys. Because you might as well get two, because sometimes you can't reset the experiment, you don't have time. Alright. That's, yeah, nice. If I make it too much smaller, it's... Uh, kind of a pain because the price goes up. If you look at how much that costs, it actually costs less the bigger you make it. <laughs> oh yeah, boys, we're doing science today. Now, if I make it really teeny weeny, it costs a lot more, which makes sense. Don't want to make it OP by just making all your things 0.1 meters. Bit unfair. So we're gonna do that. Is there anything else that we might need? Pog frog. Hashtag nuke Duna. Oh, yep. Do that in just a minute. Is there a download link to all your mods? Uh, as far as I'm aware, no. There's, But I've, I've put it in the description of the KSP video. If you want to manually do that, which... Sounds painful, but it's, it's definitely possible. Uh, okay. So we got docking ports. Got all the science in here. Yeah, so if you wanna... If you wanna follow along at home, go to the KSP video. There should be a... Uh, the mod list. It's kinda long though. Ooh, what am I doing? Being a dum dum. So this is our Landy Boy. I'm gonna call it Landy Boy. Save, and I'll save it as a sub assembly. Hello. Okay, I guess not. All right. Fuck it. Upside down it goes then. So, actually, before we do anything, before we make the launch system and all that, let's let's do a simulation. We can test things. I'm gonna go to... Fuck. Shit. Stop. Undo. Thank you. We're gonna go to Duna. We're gonna... Never mind, we're not doing a simulation. Actually, no, no, no. Orbiting... No, no, no. No, no, we are, we are, we are. We'll orbit Duna at 51,000 uh... start <laughs> hashtag nuke duna hmm... perhaps a 
solar panels or RTGs? Yeah, I should probably do that, shouldn't I? Don't have RTGs unlocked yet. Oh wow, look at that. I'm so skilled, we got to dinner. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Oh no. It's doing this glitch when you time accelerate and it just jumps you forward. Not pog. Decidedly anti pog. But not to worry. Is it gonna lag really bad? No. No operational SAS modules or pilots. This guy's a scientist. You silly, silly sausage. Why are you here? Alright, well, let's just test. Not to worry. Today we test. My streamer is a cheetah! A cheater! I'm a hacker. Yeah, look, simulation active. It's not it's not real. We all live in a simulation. Sorry to say. Okay. Okay, we can physical warp. <laughs> Just can't like time warp. <laughs> oh what the fuck? Piss off. That time warp frog is not pog. Hmm. I don't know what you mean by time warp frog, but it is not pog. Look at that. Look at the light. What does he see? <laughs> oh, it's gonna make me sick. Oh, check this out. This is actually really cool. If you you can click these buttons, yeah, you can like do the entire thing from inside the thing. But I don't want to do that. We. Okay. Come on, hurry up. Slow you on down. Say bruh moment. Bruh. Jump out and do a flip. Oh, yep. Can I actually jump out? <laughs> I can. I suspect there's a bit too much air resistance right now and I just fly away, but... Yeah, this is a simulation, but, you know... I only have so much time. Bruh, please upload more video- No, I refuse to make more money. I will not do it. You can't make me. Also, probably a shielded docking port. Eh, who cares? I don't have it unlocked. It's unnecessary. Alright. Pop into shoot. Or not. I mean, whenever you're ready, you know? Whenever you feel like it. If you're feeling zany, maybe pop the shoot. Oh, easy. I don't even need to use the engine. Hell yeah! Mini is harder to dock, eh? I don't, I don't even know if I'm gonna actually dock them. There's no real need. I'm just... I'm gonna have one crew. It'll just hop between both. There's no need, reason to dock. And... I don't even need to throttle up. How good is this? Maybe. Ooh. Bit of a hard landing. Hashtag nuke Duna. Alright, if you insist. <laughs> I think that'll do, right? Yeah. I think that'll do. 
Let's just make sure that the uh, center of mass is in line so uh, we can fly the thing, you know, because that's clearly very important with this particular craft. I was gone, did anyone die? No, I haven't even flown a manned mission yet, so... No. It's because I'm scared. I am but a coward. Nuke Duna is appro approved by Pogfrog. Say my name, please. Andrew. There you go, I said it. Alright, it is, it is a little heavy. I'll give you that. But not to worry. We've, we're going around the minimum moment of inertia right now, so, you know, not to worry, not to worry. Nuke Duna is, in fact, approved by Pogfrog. Send feet. <laughs> well, yep. <laughs> I will send feet now. Since you've paid me, you know, I, I guess I just have to. Alright. Down we come. Operation Nuke Duna confirmed. It is a go. I repeat, Operation Nuke Duna is a go. The sim costs are not changing. Huh. When I time accelerate, they don't move. <laughs> How nice. I guess I'll just stay on 2x time acceleration then. It's not like I need to be very precise right now. Alright. Pop that off. Oh, you love that noise, don't you? You love to hear it. Oh, yeah. That's, that's great. See ya, nuke. Yeah, okay. Let's just turn that down just a hot minute. Okay, what I'll do, right, is I'll I'll hit uh, I'll hit up retrograde. So we can watch the thing explode from the capsule. I think that would be quite poggers. Zar bomba Th nuclear thermonuclear weapon. Alright, now if we press C and spin ourselves around. Why is this backwards? Alright. This is... Why is... Oh my god, this is so painful. I should time accelerate to cancel out the rotation. Become member of this channel for good things and so you can spam frogs in chat. Give money to your favorite online frog, Martin. I could not agree more, to be honest. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for advertising for me. I don't have to do it now. What? 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 what, what uh, where'd it go? Hello? Is it behind us? Why? Can we switch to it? Fuck it. Switching to the nuclear bomb. <laughs> Nuke died. Very sad. I don't think it did. Oh. Spam and pog frogs. I like to see it. Why is it... Bruh. Why is it in perfect orbit right now? Okay. F fuck you. Hyper edit. Misc tools. Open the semi-major axis aligner. What the fuck? This thing can't turn, can it? Mm, boost button speed. Negative 10. Right control, B. Is that not going to work? Oh my god, this is so boring. This is not a pog frog moment. 
not frog pog. <laughs> what am I doing? No. I'll do that at the end of the stream. You gotta- you gotta wait. There you go. That's how I improve my watch time. You have to wait now. Okay. So. Back to serious talk. Serious face on. Please put your silly face away. And put your silly- f your s not silly. Put your intelligent face on. Uh, that'll do it. Put some batteries in. Oh, yep. Some communications, maybe? Nah. And now what we need is a probe module, even if it doesn't have connectivity. Uh, it just gives you SAS and things like that when there's a Kerbal inside. So if we have Urk, the scientist, fly in this, then, um, then he'll be able to use SAS and do all the things that a pilot would normally have to do. So now, uh, let me just get another one of these. Oh, yep. Chuck that on there. And now if we reroute, there we go. That's our root part. So that's the main part now. And if I do control from here... Yeah, whatever. So, I'm gonna chuck a heat shield on here. It's just nice and simple. Lander. From, you know, interplanetary space. Nothing too difficult, really. Make sure to f pog and frog, and frog pog. That's incredibly important. <laughs> Be it, you made me wait. This is my last super chat. Have fun starving. <laughs> I, I'm guessing because you said... You said because. No, no, how could you, no. Damn. Alright, what's the most efficient- ah! I will not starve. I refuse. We can get rid of that thing, can't we? <laughs> That's stupid. Alright. Vacuum. Where are we at? 950- That's terrible. Awful. I think we need a bit more beef. Bit more meat. That'll do. That's a lot more meat. That is a significant amount of more meat. And now what we're gonna do is just fuck it. Joe. Joe is back. Joe the subassembly is back. Except I can just get rid of all this. Very good. Okay. So, do we have enough Delta V? Let's see. These guys go... This stage can maybe get us to orbit. Maybe, maybe not. Hmm. Well, you know what? This problem can be solved quite easily by just adding more boosters. Johnny Deep. Okay. I agree with this statement. Landy Boy. I guess we'll just stick with Landy Boy. Or were we going to call it something ha ha funny? I don't remember. Uh, this thing. This thing. Hello? Thank you. Why is it doing that? That's very annoying. Okay. That is one 
long dude. One lengthy lad. Not to worry. And we're overweight. Fuck! I name it the pog. Fr okay, yeah, I, I actually will. Pog frog one, because you just know this is going to be a series of landers and launches and all that. Uh, so we can't add more boosters. Well, we can. We'll just add more boosters in a different way. Quite simple, really, if you think about it. Oh, yes. Name it pog frog. Yes. Uh, so now what we can do is we will add more boosters, just not these boosters, they'll be different. So we'll take these off, pop these on. <laughs> that is beautiful. Nice and lopsided. It is great. That's just what I wanted. So now, we want all the engines to fire at once. But, of course, these will run out first. These little ones. Then these will run out. Then we'll pop the fairing. Oh, no, we don't want to pop the fairing up after the... Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, we do, actually. Then we'll pop the fairing up, and then... Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Is there anything we're missing? Martini noticed me. There you go, I've noticed you. Ah, oh, yes, of course, we're missing the Zar bomb. How could I forget? <laughs> Sorry, guys. I don't know what I was thinking, really. Reading this chat has reduced my IQ. <laughs> You're welcome. You're very welcome. Ooh, I just remembered. I just remembered that we have these things, which are kind of cool. Right, you have these little modules. You can stick in places. I don't really know how they work. But we can try, baby. How does... How does this work? Aha. Aha! It's upside down. This... <laughs> this is proving difficult. Why don't we just... Uh, reroute to this part. And then just... Take this off. Uh-oh. Okay. Flip this around. And... Put... This cargo thing in. Actually, this only costs 750. Is this smaller? It is. So, when we open this guy, and chuck one of these bad boys in. Okay, fuck it. it. Has three inventory slots, I see. And this one has six then. Okay. Now, can, can we scale them? We cannot scale them. That would have been kind of funny. Uh, I think we can actually stick them in here. Yeah. Yeah. Stick these here. Stick that there. So just as long as we have an exposed science part near each, near the ladder for each one, we'll be good. Okay, but when are we going to nuke Duna? <laughs> Great question. I guess you'll have to wait and see. So now that we have that, why don't we get all these? I've never used these before in my entire life, but since we have this thing that can store six... Hey, it worked! Alright, chuck that in, chuck that in, chuck that in. Uh, we're missing this one. That's the weather analyzer, that's the goo monitor, yes. Alright. Sick. Needs a deployed central station to operate. So we have one with the solar panel. We have... I think we have got everything. For this, we might want a ladder. Just came to mind. A ladder would probably be useful. Where is it? There's the static ladder. I want the one that moves. This one, or this... Uh, this one. Check it out, boys. All right, Pog Frog One. Uh, okay, I'm gonna save it first, and then I'm gonna take this off, and we're gonna test it again because I hate you. 
and I don't want to launch because I'm scared. Yes, that's right. I hate all of you and I don't want you to enjoy this stream. Uh, go. Put a tes bomb and bomb and just blah blah blah. Okay. Love your videos. Thank you. Legalize recreational plutonium. No. Nah. Don't want to. It's all mine. It will not be legalized. Okay. Why does it do that? That's annoying. Now, does the time warp things bug still? Oh, never mind. We're in the atmosphere. Okay. Hey, look. So, this is a scientist, but we have SAS controls because of the probe core. Even though the probe core is not connected at all. How good. How good. Okay, now let's remember. Time warp 2 means we don't have to pay any money for the simulation. <laughs> Sentient being. <laughs> Sticky. I see you, meat man. No, I want a half uranium 238. No! Galaxy brain time. Mmm. Indeed. Look at the width of my brain. Is this version 1.11? Nope. This is version 1.8.1. Oh, the next test is if we can get... Yeah, okay, this is a good This is a good simulation to do, actually, because um, I don't know if we can get from the surface into orbit. <laughs> but, to be fair, even if we can't quite make it to orbit, we can just jump out the pod take the experiments and then use the jetpack to fly away. Ah, uh, science man dude guy. That's that's me. <laughs> I don't know. Who who are you referring to there, mister? Come on. Slow it on down, buddy. Legalize recreational thorium. Yes, I've been huffing thorium in my, in my spare time. You gonna open? Okay. Alrighty. Look at you still talking when there's science to do. It's a simulation, who cares? What's this? Why is <laughs> why is the science junior sticking out? I don't even care. No, back you go. Make a squad video. Yeah, I might do that. I haven't got squad, but my friends have it, and they say it's fun. All right, cool. Let's uh, let's see how this thing works. Make a squad video. Yes. Okay. So, fuck, fuck. Yeah, the squad does look pretty fun. How does this work? Oh, oh, sick. Okay. So now, yo, <laughs> that's so cute. You can rotate it. And space to place. Sick. Oh, what? F interact. Okay. I have no idea what I'm doing, but this is quite cool. Can I just reach from here? Oh, I can. So we'll pop that in. We'll place it down. Pop that on down. Very good, very good. I 
I don't really care where they go. I'm just going to chuck them all down. Pop that down. Pop that down. And that down. Look at us go. Got a whole... Got the whole squad. Okay, now... Status unpowered. I just... <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. F interact. So, do I have to plug these in or something? Do I need cables? F interact. Huh. Module deployed. Unpowered. Power units produced one. Aha. Uh -huh. Science zero per hour. Unpowered. <laughs> I'm so confused. <laughs> How do I power these? Someone tell me. <laughs> do satisfactory. I will. Eventually. Please, someone, somebody help. Please. I don't know how to do this. Point it to the sun. It is pointing at the sun. I just, like, this is unpowered. How do I power it? That's the question. Maybe I have to pick it up. Oh, okay. <laughs> huh. I'm very confused. Hey, YouTuber, play game or else threat. <laughs> Make it closer together? Is that what you're supposed to do? They seem pretty freaking close. Total power available, one. Okay, this one's working then. Experiments connected, three. Okay. So we just need it close to this thing. Oh, that's so cool. I love those animations. Is that good? Have I done it? One solar panel makes one power. You need five to power sun. Are you serious? Okay, good I, Good thing to know. Power units required. Power units produced zero. Power units produced one. But that's going to this, right? Yeah, total power need five. Ugh. Ah, uh, we need more solar panels. Okay. Okay. I see. I see how it is. Oh, damn, son. Love your stuff, bro. Thank you. 35 Canadian pesos. Thanks, Mr. Visby. Oh, I'm so confused. Unpowered. Power required one. But this one's taking it. Okay. Okay, I think I think I get it. I think I get it. I'll pick this one up and see if it powers this one when I do that. Connection, not... Oh, well. Okay, I get it. I get it. I get it now. I get it. I understand. I understand. Okay, we'll do this again. A high-level engineer can increase the power they make. Ah! It's okay. It's a simulation. It doesn't... It's not important. It is a simulation, mate. So... Maybe I should leave this this stuff for when I do missions with three crew members so that I have a scientist and a uh, engineer. Because, yeah. Otherwise it's a bit of a pain. So I'll, I'll save that for later. But it will happen. Worry not. I'll remove the ladder, because that was not needed. All right, we've we've tested this thing fairly extensively. We didn't test it going back into space, though, so we, I'm sorry, but we're going to have to do that. My apologies. It's just how it be. You need a leveled engineer. Panels get plus one power per engineer level. I see. I don't think I have any engineers, actually. Well, maybe I do. Okay. So I'm guessing... Yeah, if we just have one engineer, that'll double the power of all of them. Okie doke.
what simulation mod is that? It's called Crash with a K, which I think is a good name. All right, let's slow it on down and land again while using minimal fuel. All right. Now we wait. In fact, what we can do is we can do name. 16x. Let's go. You start with one engineer. I'm aware you start with one engineer. <laughs> They're all dead. Okay. Come on. Science works the same with scientist levels. Add a probe core for it. Yeah, that's what I've done. There's a probe core down here. Uh, so science works the same with science le scientist levels. Yeah. Okay. Well, this guy's level two. Oh, that's right. Yeah, if we mouse over him, we can see. Uh, vessel re science return. Part science return. Reset experiments. Yeah. Uh, let me do this. Okay, let me read that again. Reset, okay, so you can reset experiments, run experiments from EVA, science generation rate 45%. So I'm guessing he generates more science from the things on the ground then? I don't know. <coughs> the engineer is dead. Yep. The engineer is in fact dead. Oh, I'm going to end up like actually getting to, uh, to Duna. And then you guys are going to be like, no, it's just a simulation, bro. Wait. <laughs> and everyone's going to leave. Uh, let's not do that. Gently does it. Can we get a lecture? No. I'm stupid. I don't know anything. Alright. <coughs> Very good. Okay, we've been here so long. Oh my god, we gotta leave. Okay, bye-bye. How does this work? Let's see. Do we have enough fuel? Who knows? It's not very aerodynamic, this square shape. This flat surface. <coughs> we done it. Not yet. We doing it. You need an energy device. For what? For what? Por qué? He flying. Ooh. <laughs> so, uh, guys have a good night's sleep last night. Is the weather nice? You know, uh, eat good food or some shit. I don't fucking know. He do be soaring, though. I really do. I suspect we're going kind of slow because of this thing's incredible aerodynamics. Really just stellar work. Have you played Satisfactory? I have played Satisfactory. It is quite fun. The weather is shit. <laughs> Damn. Sleep, sleep, what is sleep? Well, damn. Uh, people now, I say one thing in Spanish and people are like, do you speak Spanish? I don't speak Spanish. <laughs> no hablo español, señor. You can plus F12. That's right, I can. Oh, wow, so many aerodynamic forces. Well, now we're high up enough that doesn't really matter. But I reckon it would have mattered. I think we've got enough. 
seems to me like we've got more than enough fuel. Um, Do you speak Taco Bell? <laughs> I speak Mexican. <laughs> He's speaking the language of the taco. <laughs> Uh, no, I don't actually speak Spanish. I know very little. I speak fluent American, says someone. <laughs> All the guys with with uh, the Spanish like usernames in the chat are like <laughs> piping up. Are we up in space yet? No. Can you speak Polish? No. <laughs> I know one word in Polish and it's kurwa. Okay. Yeah, I think we've got enough fuel. I think we'll be right. No need to worry, gentlemen. We are currently pogging. <laughs> Burns at apoapsis are more efficient. They're actually not. Burns at periapsis are more efficient. It's just because you're burning sideways, fully, fully sideways. That's what makes it more efficient. Not because you're at apoapsis. All right, let's, let's fix this orbit. Here's a shit orbit. Okay. Yeah, we can get into orbit. And we have some fuel left over that we can transfer back because we have the docking port. Cool. That costs 215 funds, wow. Can you speak German? Like a teeny weeny bit. And my accent is absolutely trash. Because German's incredibly hard to speak. Oh, I've just gone and loaded the wrong ship, haven't I? We don't want Joe Bidoom, we want, uh, we want Pogfrog. Pogfrog 1. Excuse me. Are we missing anything since the last upgrade? I don't think we are. I think it's all the exact same. How about in here? Ah, yes, we are. Cargo unit, get out of here. Get out of here! Okay, what? What were we doing? I don't know. We're just putting a dude on Duna. Simple as that, really. Save. Launch. Let's go. <laughs> this stream is sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. Do you speak frog? Ribbit. Ribbit. Ribito. Okay. We're in, boys. We're in. We're on. The job is on. Simple as that. Are we losing electric charge? We are, but that doesn't matter. Because we have a person in the thing this time. So, let's chuck another alarm on. Pog frog one transfer window. Alarm from... Uh, what? Okay. Kerbin to... Shit. Duna. Go. And time accelerate. EA Sport mode. Let's go. Do you speak crazy, frog? 
<laughs> now that that is a language I can speak, my friend. What's your goal with this beautiful creation? It's going to Duna. Hey, look, we're actually doing it in the daylight. Imagine that. <laughs> Holy shit, that looks so... <laughs> That's terrible. Okay. Uh, why is it backwards? That's bad. That's very bad. You, sir. You, sir. Control from here. I bet... I bet this cheeky lad is in the lander can. But that doesn't matter. Alright, three, two, one... Go. Hell yeah, baby. We're doing it. Now, there's no emergency abort sequence or anything, so if he dies, he dies, you know? If something if something goes wrong, Elza is dead. Wait, pilot. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> it's not what I wanted. It's okay. We'll just have to extend the mission. Oh my god. <laughs> that was that was bad. It's okay. What we can do, what we can do is we can launch another mission with the scientist guy because there are two command seats. And then just have this guy take the other rocket back. Oh, that's silly. Feeling like a sausage, RN. Don't hit me up. Oh! Me on my way to buy Bobux. Not to buy, just, just two Bobux. Do you speak Mandarin Chinese like a good Australian? <laughs> no. The only Chinese I know is from Battlefield 4. And I don't think that counts. And the word guailo, which means like foreigner or something. Or like white devil or something like that. Something kind of weird. Okie dokie, lads. Let's uh, throttle down, pop this off, throttle back up. Here we go. Easy as that. What are you boys? We're getting there. Just unfortunately, this little chump right here, he's not supposed to be there. Piss off. So I'll have to, uh, I'll have to send up another mission to transfer him out. <laughs> That's a very bizarre donation but you know what it's money I'll take it have you ever boxed with a kangaroo mate what do you think I do on the weekends yep as I said weird donation but I'll take the money thank you Okie dokie. <laughs> Ejecto seat, cuz. Nah. Nah, brah. Not needed, bros. <sighs> you streaming on Twitch? No, I'm c pretty clearly not streaming on Twitch. <laughs> Uh, 
Unless I have a genuine reason to, I'm not gonna. It just doesn't seem worth it. Like, less viewers every time and, like, you know, just doesn't, doesn't sound very fun to me. Also, the, the DMCA shit that's been going on does not sound good. Doesn't sound like a, a fun and cool environment, you know? Okay. I hope that's enough fuel. Should be. Let's go back to the space center and make a quick orbital rocket. Frognot Pog. Why don't you put RCS on your shit? Who needs RCS? RCS is for poo poo heads that don't know how to, I don't know, use their rockets. You heard me. Poo poo heads, I say. Make sure you guys are hydrating right now. Oh. Okay, we're not we're not launching another pog frog. That's quite expensive. I think we're gonna launch Obama Prism Four. I'm pretty sure that's the one that made it to orbit. Yeah, this looks like it can make it to orbit. How ex Oh, that's so expensive. What the hell? Maybe this is the moon lander. I think it is. Maybe it's Obama Prism Three. <laughs> Damn, I I keep getting my Obama Prisms wrong. Gosh, this definitely doesn't have enough. Uh, what I'll do is I'll just, I'll just, I will just, simply just, get rid of that, get rid of that, no, don't get rid of that, get rid of that, simple heat shield, parachute, just take him back down, he shouldn't be up there, cheeky man snuck on the rocket. Get a decoupler. Get some boosters. Uh, you know what? Let's get big booster and then little boosters. Okay. Sweet. Should probably have decouplers, shouldn't I? That would be smart. But we all know that I may be stupid, so... Yeah. 3,302. That's at sea level. At vacuum, it's probably like 6,000. Fuck. Sick. Go Obama Prism 3. I hope the right guy is in thing. Stinky Dong. No, I'm not going to name it. It's just a temporary transportation ship for the correct Kerbal to go inside. Oh. Urk, scientist. That's our boy, and we don't have SAS modules or any of that. <laughs> any of that pussy shit. Am I right? Ooh, we're totally out of the Duna transfer window now, but... Oh well. Oh, it's four hours. Ah, it'll be fine. So what we do is we wait for them to be kind of behind. Wait, they're not behind. They're well in front. I'm... <laughs> I may be stupid yet again. Wait for them to come in behind and then... And then launch. Just as simple as that. Just go. Boof. Joe Bidome. This is not Joe Bidome. This is Obama Prism 3. Just repurposed. And made much cheaper. Okay, I really should have gotten 
some SAS control. That would have been that would have been smart. And by SAS, of course, I mean special air service. This is me, an SAS agent in Gabon. Okay, okay, it's getting a little spicy. It's getting a little spicy, boys. If we kill Urk right now, I'm gonna be not pleased. I'll just leave it at that. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> <laughs> that is awful. That is terrible. It's okay, we have heaps of Delta V, not to worry. Just slow it on down, boys. Just slow it on down. Eh. Eh. Alright, how far away is it? Oh, fucking far. I've made a terrible mistake. Just... Just, just slow down. Just, just. If Urk dies, you, we will. <laughs> will you be Urked? I will. Urk will not die though. He is too strong. You have my word that Urk will remain alive. Okay, spin her around again. Doesn't that capsule only have one room for one over? Yeah. Is the armor service still up? Yeah, it is. If you all want to play that, it is on. Like at this point, the video of the armor server makes enough money to cover it, so I'm not I'm not particularly worried. Okay. Okay, this is not proving good. If I just do this, hey, they're getting closer. The relative speed's only a thousand meters per second. Simple as. We have so much delta V, it literally doesn't matter. All right, that'll be, that'll that'll do. Suborbit, but who cares? <laughs> All right, we are approaching at high speed. <sighs> it too brute. No. Oh yeah, no no no. Mm -mm, no no no. Watch me crash into it at a, at a remarkable speed. Hello? Please don't crash. Thank you. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Bye-bye. <laughs> ah, we'll be right. Just a mild overshoot. The fact you're managing this without SAS, nah, it's not that hard. You just gotta not be bad. <laughs> it's that easy, bro. <laughs> okay, this this craft, I don't care about this craft. This craft can just stay in orbit with whoever's in that one. Elza, I think that's his name. Elzarino. Pogfrog1. Coming in for a close approach. Alright. Coming a little closer. 
And of course it's nighttime. Classic. Can't see shit. Okay, this this is difficult without SAS, but I've managed. Alright. Let's just wait a hot minute. Get the sun out. Very good. I have got the sun out, it was all me. And now we'll do some crew transfer. This is silly. Now, which one has the crew inside? Not this one. Excellent. So, we'll get in this one. Board. And Elza will be sent home. Little rat sneaking aboard. Who do you think you are? Urk crashes through the atmosphere and burns up at Mark 2. I think it'd be a bit more than Mark 2 there, buddy. 2,000 meters per second, that's like Mark 6. 7, almost. More like 6. Alright. Okay. Back on, back on the bullshit. Really. That's all this is. Oh god, the moon! Piss off! <laughs> Set as target. I'm sorry I'm not talking as much, I'm getting a bit toyed. But I want to land this. Ah. Oh. Really? That's what a five hour difference does in the transfer window? That's piss. That is certified piss. Moon gravity assist, no. Who do you think I am? Okay, well we'll burn on this node and then we'll just figure the rest out on the way. Um, so if we're there and he's there, that means we're behind. So what we want to do is kind of be in a lower orbit. That'll move us faster. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Darn. Okay. What if we shoot this way? The opposite side of the annoying moon. Oh! That's better. Okay, that uh, we'll, we'll do that. Duna is too far ahead. Look, the transfer window is out by five hours. It's not even that long. And speed. Fuck. Stop, 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 stop. Speed, thank you. I have this thing, don't I? Imagine actually using mods and not just playing the vanilla game, but with different things that you could add, but don't. Don't use time acceleration, that's cheating. Damn, bro. Alright. When this guy lands, I think that'll be the end of the stream. Don't want another Joe Bidome incident. No, we do not. 
Alright, fuck it. Burn. It's almost out of fuel anyway. So that'll be done, and then we'll do the next one. Alright, let's let's wait. Three, two, one, go. <coughs> Is this the Minecraft hack video? Yeah. Look, I made Minecraft into a sphere. <coughs> Pro tip going Mark II into the ocean is a bad idea. Well, I mean, what would you know, mister? Have you gone Mark II into the ocean? Didn't think so. This video is pog. Uh huh. I don't think this is a video, mate. I'll check in on the stream on my deathbed at 72 years when you finally make it to the end game. Oi, shut up! Oi, oi, shut up! But yeah, there's gonna be so much that I cut. So, the first few streams, I kind of did them impromptu but this time I got more of a plan so like this stream going to Duna next stream I don't know what we're gonna do probably go back to Duna <sighs> but I'm gonna try and plan out each launch that's on the video a bit better cuz I don't know I just found it a bit difficult last time you know which ones do you include which ones don't you include that sort of thing it was actually quite simple I just included all the ones from the first stream and didn't include any from the others Simple as that. Alright. Okay, now how do we how do we do this? Do I slow down? Huh. Hmm. Hmm. We just want to minimize the closest approach. Oh. Well, that does it. That wasn't that hard. Okay. Let's do some maneuver node editing. Oh, yes. This is gaming. You guys currently gaming? Because... That is, in fact, what I'm doing right now. Shit. Okay, we're gonna... Small increments. That's pretty much perfect. And normal will just... Just do that. That kind of deal. And radial again. Alright, sick. I am a gamer. Ultra gamer orbit. Absolutely. I don't know if we have enough fuel to get back. I hope we do. I suspect we will because we don't have to capture in orbit. We can just use error braking because the orbital speed is so low. Alright. Let's go. Time warp. Neurom. We in deep space. Getting back is overrated. Oh, true. I could just, like, land and then set up a permanent base down there. Oh, but I didn't think of this. So this delta V number that we have here, that includes the lander that's mounted on top. Once we get rid of that, it'll actually be way higher. Yeah, we'll be able to make it back. No problem. But I'll do that next stream. <sighs> All right. So... Alright, 
looks like we're going to have to do some fine tuning. The thrust limiter is on 1%. Okay, that might have, might have been too early to do that. Oh well. When is next stream? That's a great question. I don't know. Whenever I do it. Control locked. Ah, oh, sick. I can't delete the node. Oh well. Not to worry. And boop. Let's get it down a little lower. Let's get it down to 55. Actually, we want to error capture, don't we? Oh, well, in that case... Ah, this is bad. Just realized. So I think... I think the thing to do... Is to just push it back to the other side so that we're going the opposite direction. But we're in daylight. Oh! But we won't be in daylight because it'll meet over there. Ah, see, big brain time. Look at this, I've gotten smarter. Yes, yeah, so the sun's going to be like on this side. Ah, oh, yeah. Keyboard and mouth noises intensifies. Yeah, okay, just... I'm sorry. Pakistan Duna. You do the math. <clears throat> Oh no, we're almost under a thousand viewers. Well, whatever will I do? No. All right, we're going to go 35 kilometers. How much money would I have to donate in order to steal the nuclear launch codes and catapult humanity into <laughs> into nuclear winter? Mm. I'm going to quick save. I'm going to cheat. Because, uh, I don't, yeah, I don't want to explode. That would just be sad. Ugh. I guess I should set different conditions, like explode or not explode. I'm not, you know, if we explode, I'm just going to leave it. That'll be the end of the stream. If we do not explode, that'll be Pog. How high does the atmosphere on Duna reach? I believe it's 50 kilometers. Data expunged. That's what I do. I expunge data. Uh, let's turn it back to stand. What the fuck? <laughs> we spinning, boys. Standard warp. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of hilarious. We, 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 we. Okay, enough for that. Serious face on. Okay. So that is on the l the light side, which is good. All right, I'll just quick save. Fuck it, I don't care. Save game. Do not landing. Why not? I'm so cheeky. I can't load the game, can I? <laughs> well, I guess this is <laughs> I guess there's no need to worry about that then. Why is it lagging? Why is it lagging around Duna? I don't like this. Stop that. Stop that, mister. Oh, I swear to God, if it does this shit again, if it pulls this... If it pulls this shit again, I will not be pleased. Hey, we got control again. How good. We have 1% signal strength. Let's go. I'll get rid of all maneuvers, actually. That'll just make it easy. So, with any luck, 35 kilometers will be enough to capture and not 
uh, f- not explode and not land and any of that, any of that bad stuff. Fifteen hundred meters per second at orbital speed. Hey, it's not even lagging. How oh, good. All right. Wish me luck. Let's turn on aerodynamic forces. Why don't we have a look at those? Control Alt F4 to stop lag. Oh yeah. All right. Are things moving? Oh look, the time's increasing. <laughs> the big line is moving. Pillar men awaken. What? <laughs> Are those men in a pillar? Ah! Okay, this might be a little too low, but that's okay. <laughs> Why don't we face normal? and see if that doesn't slow us down more because now there's more surface area ah look the the aerodynamic force thing that's pretty cool he didn't get the funny damn how the fuck do you pronounce modern pseudopaths come on mate it's pretty phonetic Burning retrograde is helpful in widening your orbit. Widening. Is, it, is this a skinny orbit? This isn't even an orbit. This is a pass by. Am I allowed to claim Kerbal Mastery if I landed a pair of hypersonic jets? With re on Lathan Karima? Yeah. Yeah. That's fair enough. But. Are you going to go to Proxima Centauri B? Mmm. The real question. The real test. Of KSP grit. Bro, I just fucking farted. Nice. Good one. Okay, let's... We definitely did not go low enough, but let's just chuck that back up. Brung! Wow, we, were, we went way too high. Come on. Slow it on down, buddy. Okay. Now. It's really quite simple. What we do is we go back up and we go down to... I'm going to go 27 kilometers. I think that'll be good. Flatulence pog. No fuel, less mass, more speed. Mmm, true. Why am I here? Jesus. <laughs> That's a great question. Alright, let's turn the thrust limiter back. Ah. Oh, we can. Sweet. Come on. Hurry up. Hurry up. You know the dragon is docking to the ISS right now? Yeah, I saw it launch. That was pretty cool. Quite pog if I do say. <sighs> Want me to bring God in here? Yes. Have you played Kenshi? No. Attempt 30. I saw, <laughs> I saw it that time. <laughs> Alright, we're going to go down to 27 and see if that slows us down a bit more. Just make our orbit a little less elliptical. Mm. I'm worried fucking Ike's just going to come and ruin all of our shit. We're just going to be kind of chilling out around here and it's just going to BOOM! Smash right into us. 
would not be poggers, I don't think. Finally. <laughs> yes, I have I have watched Seth's video on that. Looks f fairly amusing. God's here. Oh, God's here. <laughs> Damn, bro. God made it. God's in the building, boys. Ike is mean. Yeah, bro. Ike is mean. Alright, so what we should, what we want to see is this thing come down all the way to like here. So let's just speed this up. Now the real question is, do we accelerate? Oh, you know what? I can measure the acceleration actually. Check this out. Look, if we open this and then check this guy out, toggle display, 0.0064G. Now what happens if we point forwards? Does it increase or does it decrease? It seems like it's increasing. Oh no, decreasing. Okay, I reckon that's actually more aerodynamic because, yeah, yeah. Makes sense. Ooh, it's getting a little spicy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, spaghetti Oh, Nah, we're good. We're good. I don't think that mothership has enough delta V to make it home. Well, see, buddy, you're looking at this number, but this number is not reflecting reality because this thing is not coming back with us. Kaboom. Kaboom. Pull up. Wah, wah. Warning. Wah, wah. Yeah, we'll be fine. We're doing fine. In fact, I'm going to face backwards, and I might even need to burn backwards a little bit. Yeah, fuck it. Let's just max drag. Good stuff. Eject over speed. 50, 40, 30, 20, 10. Retard, retard, retard. <laughs> Alrighty, boys. This is gaming. It's kind of amazing how a game that's like... I don't want to say boring, but it is it is pretty boring, is this popular. Like, I really like this game, even though it is kind of boring. Like, wow. Passing over planet, wow. Incredible. Simply incroyable. Okay, I'm going to leave the orbit kind of fucked like this. Oh, actually, maybe I'm not going to do that. But maybe I am. Yeah, let's stick it in retrograde. <laughs> Overspeed, what a casual term. We prefer pog velocity. Yes, we are currently at POG velocity. Thank you. Alright, let's get it down a bit. A bit more. Where are we at now? 38Ks? A bit more. A uh, bit more. Alright, that'll do. 150. Back up we go. Where can I find the VOD links? Uh, there's a playlist of all of them. All the KSP ones. But not the last stream. The 100k stream. That stream will remain hidden f forever. 
unless you have dull ink or you know more likely I'll probably make another discord and put it there what's your delta pog <laughs> change in pog no I don't change in pog I'm always pogging sorry What do I? Get that just over 50. There we go. Okay. Oh, lots of time. Yeah. We have time. We're going to land it. So, here's the go. What I'm going to do first is transfer the crew. Can I even do that? Transfer. Internally unreachable. Oh well. We tried, we tried. But we will transfer the crew across. Oh, it's dark. Excuse me. We'll hop in. Hop in, pop this off. Decouple. And there we go. So now, the fuck? Why is it spinning? This might be a problem later. <laughs> uh oh. It's okay, we have time acceleration. So, now what we do activate the engine and slow ourselves down a bit, just a little bit. Let's get it down to like 10Ks, it's probably enough. Yeah, I think the Kraken's taken that thing over. We'll just, we'll just let it be, for the time being. <laughs> but father, I must spin. I did not add a probe on the other part. But, it, I mean, it shouldn't be spinning, right? <laughs> It's okay. If I can't dock to it, I'll just jump Urk over, because this thing does have a probe core. I'll jump Urk over to that, and then I'll dock that thing, and it should be fine. Alright, boys. Here we go. We're coming on in. Alright, there we go. Also, let's change the min pressure of all these. Very good. And let's slow down. <coughs> it lives in Spain, but without the A. <laughs> Spin. <coughs> Mothership is going to error break to the surface. No, it's not. Mothership's doing just fine. Nice, hovering just around a thousand viewers. Pretty pog. Pog all day, pog all night, pog is love, pog is life. Facts. You wouldn't download a spaceship. <laughs> I wouldn't. All right, pop the shoots, pop the legs. Here we go, boys. We're coming in. Final approach. Oh, I forgot to do all this science. That's all right. We'll do it on the way out. Uh, flying low. I might as well just get all these then. Oh my god. One Canadian peso. Thank you, Mitch. Halo. Hello, Tristo. Look, you're watching me land on Mars. But it's not Mars, it's Duna. Oh. Let's go. Let's go. Alright, see this EVA report? You want to know how we get this EVA report? 
We perform some shenanigans. Very good. EVA report acquired. All right. We're doing it. We're getting there. How high up are we? 400 meters. And slow it on down. Do a flip. Do a flip. <coughs> and hey, we did it. Seismic scan. Hmm. Oh, let's go. All right. Uh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to be boring and do all this before planting the flag. Collect data. Look at that. We can restore it. Amazing. Take data. Collect data. Restore. Very pog. Very, very pog. Okay, and now we do that. And then do that. And then we do this. And we do that. And we do this. Ain't this exciting? Take that and then collect this. And restore that. Yada yada yada. Bada bing bada boom. We in there, baby. Baby! Alright. All right, we're planting the flag, boys. Let's get rid of that. Oh, you know what? I'm going to redo that because the fucking aerodynamic forces thing got in the way. I want to use this in the video. So, plant flag. Boom. Okay, what's the site name? I need to know. Tell me now, monkey. Everyone's saying monkey. I'm not going to put monkey. <laughs> pee pee poo poo come moment. It is. This is a pee pee poo poo come moment. I'm glad you're all sharing in it with me. Uh. Hmm. Random chimp event. Alright. Uh, monkey planet. Now claimed. What do we say? In this great and profound moment we go... Ooh, ooh, ah, ah, ooh, ooh. The monkey claiming this land. Excellent. All right, there we go, boys. There we go. Pee pee poo poo come piss. Yes. Thanks for joining in this wonderful journey. Uh, we probably have a good amount of science that we've racked up, which is always nice. And also check this out, we can fly. Just, just barely. Can we deploy the chute? I wonder if that works. No, it does not. Disarm. All right, let's fly up back into the pod. And here we go. Ah, this is where we ended, lads. It's been a good stream. Uh, yeah, I, I'll probably do another one soonish, and I'll be working on the video. Damn that! Oh, I can't fucking read that. Also, slap my cucumber. Okay, <laughs> I'll do that. All right. Ah, oh, 
I gotta piss. I gotta scratch my balls. I have a lot of shit to do, you know? I got things that need doing. So, I'll see you guys. I'll see you guys later. <laughs> Adios.